let us start executing the program now we go to program project new microvision project create a folder on the desktop and i create a new folder here as pgm4 and in this folder i have a file pgm4 and i say save we select lpc2148 select this and okay say no because it's an assembly language program we go to file new and then type the program here let the very first line be with the tab position save the file um with array 4.s it's some name that i'm giving and it's getting saved in the same program same folder so we have all the code words here been highlighted create an environment by clicking on project and manage choosing the components select the file that we want to add and select the file type here click add and close and okay so we see here the program array4.s is loaded in the target now let us build the program that is we compile and we see the program is error free and run the program yes comes to evaluation mode now i will just trace this program uh, for one iteration and for you to understand what, how it is working we have the first instruction getting executed so r5 is loaded with 6 then we have uh, the next instruction so as i said r1 is getting the address where we have 0038 my values are been there values are dcw which indicates it's a um, defined constant word and now let us see by looking at the memory and the address by typing this address we will see all our values that have been there so the number is uh, 4 5 6 and 3 see as you can see the numbers is here 1 1 2 2 3 3 this is these are the numbers which are being stored in the location where my value is containing that is and we are moving it to the register r1 then uh, r2 takes the very first number and then as you can see r1 is incremented after transferring the value and it is this is a new value r3 gets the value of masking then we have after masking we have the number here 00111 which is there it adds the number and then the result is stored in r0 r5 is decremented to 5 it is not equal to 0 where you can also see in the cps a flag that zero flag is zero and uh, so it goes back to the loop location the next value is being transferred to this again it does the and operation by masking it and then the numbers r0 is going to be 33 in this fashion it executes the program and uh, when you run the whole program and when i click on this stop you have the value as r0 the final sum that we want is going to be 0001665 and it is moved to the location where my result is available so uh, if you have traced it earlier probably my location was 40456 and 7 so my answer what i have stored in this memory location as you can see we have the number as 00001665 okay which is stored in this location this is how we execute the program and you can get back to your um editor mode by clicking back on this stop debugging session this is the execution of the program thank you so much for viewing the video